That was a very solemn opening. Let's say number one very solemnly. Number one. <laughs> if you will tear away the tear away sheets, sign those out, fill those out. Those are attendants to let us know you were here. When the offering bowls come around in a little bit, that will let us know that you were here today. And we love knowing that you're here. Also, if this is the day you would like to join our church, there are how to join cards in the pew pockets in front of you. At the end of the service today, there'll be an opportunity for you to come up and join our church. Say number two. Academy, Spring Academy 2017 starts next Sunday. We have all of our teaching slots filled. <laughs> that means you. All right, and if you're not clapping, you're not, then I assume you want to just put out that you didn't get to volunteer and you'll be ready to teach with us next semester, and I'm very excited about that. Say number three. Our VBS registration, our online registration goes live today. And if you want to register today, right after Children First, you can come up to the Children's Wing to register for VBS. I know a lot of you are here today to audition for the Children's Spring Musical, which will be right after the service. You're welcome to come right on up and do a paper registration. Get that all taken care of. We're doing superheroes. So imagine cape, tights, Dr. Brewster. I'll say no more. And say number four. I would like to invite the Wagner family to come up at this time. Come on up, Wagner family. They have a special announcement that they would like to make. Doesn't Davis look nice? Her daddy too. There you go. There you go. focus on the little things and that's very very special and not only just the children's ministries but most all of the other ministries of the church and so excuse me you're a little heavy that's a good thing <laughs> right almost anyway we just wanted to say thank you mr mark and thank you to all the children's ministries and and we just want to say to the, to the parents that obviously yes ma'am then, <laughs> there you go. Oh, you want to say something? Thank you. All right. And you know, giving is green on your healthy discipleship plate. So get some green on your plate. Now, with that in mind, watch my hands when I do like this. Everybody stands up. 
Oh my goodness, this is the first Children First of 2017 and it's showing. Let's warm ourselves up. Everybody hands way up in the air. We're going to shake this hand five times and go one, two, three, four, five. This hand five times and go one, two, three, four, five. This foot five times and go one, two, three, four, five. This foot five times and go one, two, three, four, five. Then this hand four times and go one, two, three, four, and so on. Count out nice and loud. Ready? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. 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 One, two, three, four. Four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, 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 one. All right, now stay up. So oh, there we go. All right, there we go. So our first song is called Do to Others. This whole service is gonna be about a lot of do's and don'ts. So we're gonna start with a do, and it goes like this. Sarah can have the key. So it goes like this. Do, 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 do to others, do, do, do. Do to others, do, 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 do to others as you would have them do to you. Easy enough, right? If you sing do, that's 90% of the lyrics. And then you're going to turn your neighbor and you're going to go, A do, 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 be, do. Then turn another neighbor and go, do, 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 be, do. So everybody turn to a neighbor, gaze lovingly in their eyes, and go, do, 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 be, do. Freeze. Don't they look amazing? Turn to another neighbor and go, do, 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 be, do. Yeah. All right. We're going to sing the whole song twice. Sarah, hit it. Sing out. Here we go. Do, 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 do to others. Do, 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 do to others. Do, 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 do to others as you would have them do. Turn to a neighbor. Do, 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 do. Another neighbor. Got it. We're gonna sing it again a little bit louder this time. Here we go. Do 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 to others. Do 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 to others. Do 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 to others as you would have them do to a neighbor. Do 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 to you another neighbor. Do 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 to you. Yeah, give your brains a kiss. Now this next song is a classic. We've done it many times. It goes like this. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Praise ye the Lord. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Praise ye the Lord. And then we flip it. Praise ye the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise ye the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise ye the Lord. Halle and then we all sing. Praise ye the Lord. And we got to put the very end as cha-cha showing a cha-cha-cha. Now here's the deal. Say, what's the deal, Mr. Mark? We're going to have a little more fun with it. So watch my hands. Have a seat. So this side of the room, you're going to be my side of the room. This side of the room is going to be Cha-Cha and Nancy's side of the room. Now, when my side of the room starts singing, we're all going to stand up. And then when their side does their part, they stand up and we sit down and so forth. So watch me. Here we go. So my side stands up first for the beginning of the song. Sarah, here we go. This half is so a hallelujah. We're going to sing it nice and loud. Ready? Here we go. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. You got it. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Now you stay up. Cha-cha-cha. Good. Everybody down? We're going to do it again. Starting this time on this side of the room. I want more cha-cha-cha at the end. That's a very good cha-cha-cha. Yeah. Now sit down on your cha-cha-cha. 
Our Bible memory verse today is a classic. Your word is a lamp to my feet. Say that. And a light to my path. Now we're going to use our bodies to do it, and you're going to stomp in place on the words with your word is a lamp to my feet. Let's try that. Your word is a lamp to my feet and a light to my path. Let's put the whole thing. Who thinks I can put the whole thing together? Okay, here we go. Your word is a lamp to my feet and a light to my path. You think we can do it faster? Yeah, kids, you can do it faster? Yes, all right, here we go. Your word is a lamp to my feet and a light to my path. Who wants to do it in super slow motion? Ready, here we go. Your word is a lamp to my feet and a light to my path. Boom. So kiddos, no matter how fast, how slow, no matter how bumpy, how smooth, God's word is on the path with us, helping us. Let's all stand as we sing together one of the great hymns of our faith, Holy, Holy, Holy. standing for our morning prayer, and please echo each line after me. Loving God, help us to be strong. Loving God, help us to be strong. In choosing right instead of wrong. In choosing right instead of wrong. Help each of us live a life that's true. Help each of us live a life that's true. And show love in the things we do and show love in the things we do. All together, amen. Amen. You may be seated. Procession leaders, thank you so much. You can go back to your spots. And we're doing a whole year this year of our theme is 12 quintessential Bible stories. And so today our Bible story is a very important one. It's a great way to start our spring academy. And for that, we have a very special person who's going to reveal our theme. Let's give that person a drum roll now. The Ten Commandments. Thank you, Moses. Let's give Moses a big round of applause. What a great way to start our, our uh, academy year off. We're talking about the, the do's and don'ts and some of great God's great do's and don'ts, the Ten Commandments. It was a long walk down that mountain, wasn't it? You did great. All right. You can, if you want, Moses, if you want to hang out, you want to hang out with us? I feel like Jimmy Fallon. Moses is dropping by a little bit later. All right. And over on the other side, Harper, would you show us the sign language for the Ten Commandments? Yeah. All right. Let's see. This is a complex one, so let's watch very carefully. I think you did it. 
All right, let's try it together. I'm not going to question it. Let's try it again. Will you show us how to do it one more time? So, uh uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay, let's do sign language applause for Harper. Thank you so much, Harper. Great job. Rusty, I think you've got some friends that want to talk to us about some do's and don'ts. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, Rusty. Following rules, which is a very complicated thing sometimes when you're a kid. So who do I have first? What is your name? Ella. This is Ella. I want to say hi to Ella. Hi. Ella, say hi to everyone. Hello. So Ella, let's come over here so you can face out and can see you. I like her shoes today. She's ready for whatever the weather will throw at her. That's very cool. Ella, do you have any rules that are really hard to follow? Working hard because my friend is talking a lot. Ooh, a chatty friend. What's your friend's name? Xavier. So Xavier makes it hard for you to work hard? <laughs> yes. Why is that? Because he's always talking. Is this a class? Is he one of your class friends? Yes. I can really relate to this story, Ella. You know why? Who was I liking this story? Who do you think? You or Xavier? Me. No. <laughs> I was like Xavier. You know what they always put on my report card? Yes. I told you earlier. Do you remember what it was? Rusty needs to learn to talk at the appropriate times. That's right. So I was like Xavier. What do you do to get through the day and follow that rule? I ignore it. Good strategy. Why is that rule so important, though? Why is it so important to try to work hard? Because you need to get your work done or else you're going to get bad grades. That's very true. Ella, thank you very much for that story. Everyone say thank you to Ella. All right, next up, what is your name, sir? Colin. This is Colin. Everyone say hi to Colin. Colin, say hi to everyone. Hello. Colin, is there a rule that's hard for you to follow? I'm getting home before dark. Ooh, I remember that one too. Getting, who had trouble when they were a kid getting home before dark? Show of hands. Yeah, you've got, you've got a lot of compadres out there with that rule. Why is that rule so hard? It gets dark, you come home. Because I want to um, stay at my friends longer and play more. Ooh, that's true. Sometimes you kind of lose track of time. Have you ever not made it home quite before dark? Yeah. Yeah. Why is this such an important rule, though? Um, Because if I don't get home before dark, then my mom will worry. That's true. Mom and dad do worry when you're not home before dark. So thank you, Colin. Those are great rules. We're going to try to keep following them. Say thank you, everyone. Or everyone say thank you. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Now it's time for a little Threadbare Theater. <laughs> Oh, hey, Wendell. Long time no see. Yeah, too long, Lorraine. I'm just glad we finally get to hang out. Yeah, me too. So, what do you want to do? Oh, uh, I don't know. Uh, whatever you want to do, Lorraine. Really? Mm-hmm. Well, okay. Uh, why don't we play a game? Yeah. The anything game. The anything game? Well, how do you play? Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm just kind of making it up as I go along. Well, you know, we can just, you know, do anything. Anything? Anything. I can't think of anything. Yeah, me neither. This is a pretty boring game. Mm-hmm. Oh, uh, maybe we should add a rule. What? A rule? No way. Rules make things harder, like school. Well, uh, we could make it a, a super easy rule. A super easy rule, huh? Uh-huh. Okay, well, how about this? Okay. The rule is that you have to listen very carefully and do whatever I say. Okay, let's give it a try. Really? Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> all right, here we go. Uh, raise your hands. Oh. Wave them all around. Yeah. Uh, hop up and down. Yeah. Cluck like a chicken. Blah, 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 Make a silly face. Blah. Cluck like a chicken while making a silly face. Blah, 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 Turn blah, around. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lorraine, this game is pretty boring. Well, I don't know. I kind of like it. Yeah, but I'm just doing whatever you say. Yeah, that's why I like it. Yeah. Maybe huh? we should add another rule. Like, I have to do whatever you say, but only when you start with Simon Says. But, Wendell, Simon Says is already a game. Mm-hmm. I want to be more original. Oh. <gasps> why don't you do whatever I say, uh-huh. but only when I start with Janice Says. How is that any different? Wendell is totally different. Come on. Simon is a boy's name. Janice is a girl's name. Oh, okay. Well, let's play Janice Says. Okay, great. <laughs> oh, hey, how do, why don't we get our friends to 
play along. Yes, we should. Hey, friends, you want to play Janice Says? Huh? Yay! <laughs> oh, Mr. Mark, don't you think that's a great rule? Just do whatever Janice says? Yeah. Okay, here we go. Listen carefully. Mm -hmm. Janice says, stand up. Janice says, raise your hands. Put them down. What? Ah, -ha. Janice didn't say. Oh. <laughs> Janice says, put your hands down. Yeah, okay. Janice says, hop up and down. Janice says, hop faster. Stop. Janice didn't say. Oh. Uh, no. Janice says, stop hopping. Yeah, oh. Janice says, shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Louder. Hallelujah. Oh, oh Janice oh, didn't boy. say. Oh. Janice says, shout hallelujah louder. Hallelujah. Oh, very good. Janice says, sit down. Uh. <laughs> oh, that was great. Give yourselves a big round of applause. Yay. What? Janice didn't say yay. <laughs> mm. oh, oh, Wendell, you were right. You know, just by adding a few rules, it, it made things more fun. Yeah, uh, when we had no rules, the game was boring. The point of rules isn't to take the fun out of life. Some of the best rules are there to help us get the most out of life. Agreed. Mm -hmm. Come on, Wendell, let's go. Okay. Ah! Janice didn't say yay. <laughs> <laughs> Lorraine, why don't we play a new game? The quiet game. Hey, that's no fair, Wendell. You know I'm not very good at that game. Yeah, I know. <laughs> hey, Janice says buy me a unicorn. No. No, oh, Janice says tell me I'm hilarious. Oh, come on. I invite everyone to stand as our friend Max leads us in what we believe. We are not alone. We are not alone. We live in we God's, God's world. world. We, we believe, believe in God, God who, who has created and is created, who, who has come, come in Jesus, Jesus the Word made, made flesh, to reconcile us and you, who works in us and others by the Spirit. We trust, we trust in God. God. We, are we are called to be the church, to celebrate God's presence, to love and serve others, to seek evil and resist evil to proclaim Jesus, crucified and risen, our judge and our hope, in life and death, in life beyond death. God is with us. We are not alone. Thanks, Thanks be, be to God. God. Amen. Amen. At this time for our Bible story, I'd like to invite our friend Moses to come back up. And Moses made a sign at home last night. Moses was, uh, had a sleepover at the child's house. And so Moses, you want to show him the sign that you made? There you go. Get it right out there in front where everybody can see it. So our, our Bible story for the month, we're exploring Moses receiving the Ten Commandments from God. And so I thought, we all know that there are Ten Commandments in the Great Commandments. There are hundreds of commandments in the Bible but there are 10 that God gave to Moses on the mountaintop. And so I thought we would have fun and play a game. I'm gonna say something and you have to figure out if it's one of the 10 commandments. If it's one of the 10 commandments, your response is God's rules rule. Let's practice your part. Ready, go. God's rules rule. Ooh, Wendell and Lorraine, that was very enthusiastic. I liked it. Let's do that again like Wendell and Lorraine did it. Ready, go. And if it's not one of the Ten Commandments, I just want it to be crickets. Like most of the jokes I tell in the announcement time and just shake your head like, I'm disappointed in you, Mr. Mark, okay? Which is fine, I've seen that look a million times before. It's no biggie. All right, are you ready? Am I put on your thinking caps? Okay, here we go. 
I am God, the only God, have no other gods but me. Very good, that is one of the Ten Commandments. How about this one? Do not make me turn this car around. How about this one? Do not make or worship idols. <laughs> Excellent, you're two for two. All right, here we go. Take all you want, but eat all you take. How about this one? God's name is special, do not misuse it. Yeah, I'm kind of using the plain English and thou shalt not take the Lord's name in vain. You know, it's not the, uh, we're not doing the King James, you know, like they spoke it back during Moses' time. All right, how about this one? Take a day of rest, a Sabbath each week. Make it a special day for God. Mm -hmm. How about this one? Never polka with a porcupine. How about this one? Honor your parents. Excellent, you're doing a great job. If the house is a rockin', don't bother knocking. It's a good rule, not with Ten Commandments. How about this one? Do not kill. Good, how about this one? If you get married, be loyal to your husband or wife. Mm -hmm. Good. How about this one? When you burp, say, excuse me. It's a good one. Maybe that's mama's. Okay. You like that one? <laughs> yeah, thanks Moses. <laughs> Do not steal. Do not tell lies about others. Good. Do not forget the remote belongs to daddy. Are you sure? I'm pretty sure if there were remotes during Moses' time, that would have been one of the Ten Commandments. How about this one? Don't wish for things that belong to others. You know, I almost put a fake one in here that was you get what you get and you don't throw a fit. But that is really that commandment, isn't it? Don't covet is really don't wish for things that belong to others is pretty much that one. Guess what? You got all 10 of them right. Give God and yourselves a big round of applause. And Moses, that's a beautiful sign you made. Would you like to sit down? I know you've, you've, it's been exhausting, what, being around for over 5,000 years and all and getting up just in time for children first. All right, Miss, Miss Nancy, if you'll lead us in our call to prayer. Okay. Do not be afraid. Do not be afraid. God is with you. God is with you everywhere you go everywhere you go God is there God is there do not be afraid do not be afraid God is with you God is with you everywhere you go So we just explored the Ten Commandments, and a lot of people think that that's all there are, but there are hundreds of commandments in the Bible. Jesus said, this is my commandment, that you love one another just as I have loved you, which is the one that's going to be our Bible memory verse for next month. There are hundreds of them. But here's what I want us to explore today. Everybody massage your brains, get your thinkers going. And I want you to imagine if there was just enough room on those tablets for an 11th commandment, some of you are thinking of a Mel Brooks movie right now, I can tell. If, you could, if there was room for an 11th commandment, what do you think that 11th commandment should be? What would you like to see be the 11th commandment? And what I want you to do is think about that for a second, and then I'm going to count to five, and when I count to five, I want you to turn to your neighbor, your grown-up or another kid, and I want you to share what you think a good 11th commandment would be. Now, you share with the others, and then you be a good listener and listen to what they say back to you, because we do to others as we would have them do to us. So get ready to e explain and talk about your, what you think would make a good 11th commandment. One, two, three, four, five. Go, start talking.
four, three, two, one. Wow, I heard a lot of good ideas out there. A lot of people have some good ideas about how to, how to make God's world, everything that God dreams it can be. And that's what we talk about with the children. Parents, one of the things I tell the kids is the Bible isn't just about what happened. We're not just reading about a bunch of old dudes in robes that lived thousands of years ago. The Bible is our story. The Bible is about what's going on today. We're a part of the Bible story. So imagining the different commandments that we could make and try to keep is a very powerful thing. And we're going to be exploring that in our academy sessions for the rest of this month. Now let us join together in the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses. We forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thy is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. Do not be afraid. Do not be afraid. God is with you. God is with you. Everywhere you go. be afraid do not be afraid god is with you god is with you everywhere you go everywhere you go god is there god is there our ushers are now busily passing around the bowls cha-cha and i are going to switch places so you can be closer to the microphone this is a sing-along offertory, and this is all about do's and don'ts, but this offertory is really more about the don'ts. And there is a refrain, and cha-cha, can we have that chord there? And here's how the refrain goes, and we all have to sing the chorus. It goes like this. Na, 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 hey! Hey, who thinks they can sing that? Who thinks they've already got it? Now I'm going to give you a clue. It really helps if you do the windshield wipers. This is one of my go-to dance moves. Okay, so if you want to do that, that helps. Let's all sing the refrain together, all on the chorus, nice and loud. Ready, go. Na 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 Hey na 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 Hey Cha Cha I think we're right so why don't we learn some things we should not do I got one Don't build a robot when you're sitting in children first don't give it laser eyes, that ain't right. Don't build a robot when you're sitting in children first. Be a good listener, be polite. Everybody, here we go. Na 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 Cha-cha. Yeah, I don't think you. anyone was planning to build a robot today. Maybe something a little bit more you useful. Never that we, yeah, just, yeah. Okay, I got a better one. All right, here we go. Don't feed your hippo when you're sitting in children first. They're unpredictable. They might bite. Who would feed a hippo don't when children first? Don't feed your hippo do when you're sitting in children first. Be a good listener. Be polite. Here we go. Na, 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 na. I think we're kind of getting the hang of I it. Think yeah. So. Now everybody catch a bubble. No need to make this place a zoo. 
And if you brought your duck, you're really out of luck. Thou shalt not let it quack until this song is through. Don't sing the chorus when you're sitting in children first. Don't na 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 with all your might. Don't sing the chorus when you're sitting in children first. Be a good listener, be polite. Everybody! Na 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 One more time! Na 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 All right, Cha-Cha, we'll try really hard not to do those things. Good. <laughs> Ushers, come forward. Let us pray. All, All of, of our, our treasures, treasures we, joyfully we joyfully give, give. the prayers the that, that we whisper, the lives, the lives that we live, our time and our talents, our hands and our hearts. God gave all of these to us. Now we'll, now do, we'll our do our part. part. Amen. Amen. So if this is the Sunday you would like to join our church, I invite you to come to the front as we sing our closing song. Uh, Dr. Mike will be down here in the, uh, to receive you if you'd like to join. Academy starts next week week. Auditions for the Children's Choir Musical are right after this up in the choir room. We'll walk you through that as you come up. VBS registration starts today. You can do that with paper registrations or you can do that online a little bit later in the day. And finally, help! All of this stuff from bell banners and globes and whatnot need to go back up into 209 in the children's wing. Many hands make light work. For our closing song, we're going to sing do, 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 do to others. Nice and jazzy. Here we go, Sarah, both times. <clears throat> Good rules to follow. Here we go. Do, 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 do to others. Do, 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 do to others. Do, do, do. Do to others as you would have them do to you. Do, 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 be, do, 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 be, do. All right. You a little snapping going? Sing it out. Here we go. Do, 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 do to others. Do, 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 do to others. Do, 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 do to others as you would have them do to. Turn to neighbor. Do, do, do. Do be do, yeah, do do do, do be do, do. And look, people came forward, you're singing, and Moses did it. Yay! <laughs> Okay, we are ready. I would love to introduce to you Ben and Kristen and Henry and Teddy. Everybody say welcome. <laughs> and it's always fun to say to you when you become a member of our church, do you reaffirm your faith in Christ? And will you be loyal to the church through your prayers, your presence, your gifts, your service, and your witness, and always have a really good time when you're here? If so, say, we will. We will. Wonderful. I hope all of you in just a moment will come down and welcome the newest members of our church. Oh, we're ready. Max, how are you doing? Thank you for letting me help you with the benediction. Are we ready, do you think? Yes. Okay. You want me to hold that? All right, you're going to take that. There we go. Our gathering will soon be ended.
Where will we go and what will we do? May grace, peace, hope, love, and joy forever accompany us. Amen. Have a wonderful week. Great job.